I offer personal readings same day for $33 and next day for $17. Check the description box below for details of how to book and subscribe to my bonus tarot channel at Val444Tarot and my vlog channel at Val Smib. Thank you. Hi Sagittarius, welcome to my channel and thank you for being here and for tuning in. I'm Valencia with Val33 Tarot and with Spirit and I'm just going to jump right in here and see what does Spirit want to tell you the most today in regards to your current situation. This is for Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising in the North Node, so of course it's not going to resonate with all of you. But for more readings after this, please go ahead and check out my husband's tarot channel at Sidekick Tarot. And my other tarot channel at Val444 Tarot and my vlog channel at Val Smib. Everything you need to know is in the description box below. And I do offer same-day personal readings. Thank you. So you are someone that feels really good about where you're at in life, your your money, wealth, status, position, your career path. You're someone that is very, you know, you, you take accountability and responsibility. You get up and take leadership for yourself and you do things for yourself and you take care of it your way, yourself. And you feel really good about that. You feel in your power when you do this. You're definitely in your strength and you're someone that's willing to kind of face any kind of challenges um, in any way, shape or form basically to kind of make those necessary positive changes for yourself here you're able to you know you're someone that's very well disciplined it feels like here yeah and you're able to you're a multitasker you know how to organize and balance yourself as well though too so you feeling very confident and strong in whatever you do for work position power money wealth status it's like you're able to really create things for yourself in a way that really helps everything kind of ha go together cohesively and smoothly here. Yeah, and it's creating a lot of, you know, success and progression. So you're able to move forward really quickly. You're seeing results. You could be traveling or relocating, but you're planning very quickly and there's good results with that. And that's creating, you know, that's making you feel very excited and happy and passionate but also creating a new chapter for yourself in life too. Something very new, a, a new amazing beginning for you. Yeah, clearly uh, to a lot of abundance and wealth material property real estate a lot of success with people society a community friends neighborhood maybe a marriage or relationship or something of business contracts but i mean there is a lot of money and wealth and abundance and that you have here all together based on that new um, chapter here that you are working on and creating here for yourself and with that there you know that has caused you to have so much awareness and clarity there is a lot of conversation and communication with who or whatever it is you are dealing with now it also helped you realize who or what was being so frustrating and causing all these arguments and fights either within you or with other people and so you're so much more clear and aware now that you don't even deal with it anymore you don't need that yeah because you're just more focused on your own independence and your own job and who you are as a person you're way more just focused with that. Like it's something where it's just kind of like, you don't have time for fighting, arguments, screaming, shouting, all for the sake of money. Like you don't need that. You're totally set. You're just kind of focused on what you know you can control with your own self, your own career path, long-term stability basically here and putting in that hard work and that effort for whatever that may be here. Yeah. And so it looks like here that 
because you, I feel like you're just someone that knows how to make executive decisions for yourself and for maybe others in life. But it's kind of like you're like, I'm set, I'm good, I'm independent. So it looks like you're going to like drop something with someone. You're going to just cut it off, end it. You don't need to be in pain anymore. You don't need to go through that. And so you're basically ending that, whatever that may be, okay, with a person, place, or thing, whichever it is. All right. And that actually has helped you want to seek solitude and keep within yourself and maybe go to therapy, wisdom, guidance, knowledge, you know, get guidance in some way, shape or form, but really keep to yourself in a way where you're gaining all that intuitive energy with yourself, that wisdom, you now, it's almost like you feel like you're better off by yourself. You just do better on your own and keeping to yourself here because it looks like fear that's causing you to feel really happy and way more excited in life, a lot more emotional um, in a good way, you know, having fun again, and maybe even you keeping to yourself, you realize maybe there could be someone that you like or have a crush on or are having fun with. Either or, it's something about you personally with your own journey and your own life and your own level of success, what you are creating for yourself here. And that's helped you make a very serious life changing decision for you in a good way. It's like you're, you're choosing to face a lot of stuff, you know, that may have been complicated or difficult. And it looks like here that it could be in the workplace where you work, where you're at, who you collaborate with, who you work with, but you're choosing to make some serious conscious decisions about that, about your career path, about your job, about maybe others around you here and putting in that hard work and just doing what it is that you need to do for you. Exactly. And so it looks like here that now you are aware. So maybe it is in the workplace, you know, or with others or social media or society, whatever it is, though, you choosing to work hard and focus on yourself actually helped you to realize or like, you know, basically be involved in the workplace in a sense, helped you realize who or what. So who in your life or what in your life with yourself has been so toxic and unhealthy and just not good. And so you became aware of that that fast and that actually helped you to realize to just cut it off. You were aware of it and you're getting rid of it. Maybe your own addictions or problems, whatever it is, you're just, you're not dealing with it anymore. You're choosing to get rid of it and let go of it. Yeah. For the sake of your own stability, for the sake of your own wealth, your own abundance, your own career path, your own independence in your job and what you want to focus on and what's more important in life. Yes, and that's caused you to actually look at and create some realistic options for yourself of what else you'd like to do for yourself in your life, what more can happen, and how can you go about that and create that for yourself. And it looks like for you is to just kind of be more hidden and mysterious and allow life to kind of reveal itself and change itself in some way, shape or form here and kind of you just trusting your own process in life, um, your own intuition, your own emotions and working through that and being okay with that and allowing life to just kind of reveal things to you as time goes on. Yeah, and it looks like here that, you know, give it time and you get exactly who you want or exactly what you want. And that's what I have for you. Thank you. Bye.